One is an art and one is, you know what I'm saying? So would you say the Illuminati exists? Hey, man, I, I, from what my interpretation of that is and what the world and all this television shit is, it's too, too totally different. Is it couches, man? That's all I'm saying. It's, it's just some couches. It's just yeah, some couches. Yeah, yeah it's some couches. It's a couch. Never so for the people room. that don't understand what we talking about when we say couches, <laughs> explain couches, man. You, you talking about some motherfucking uh, 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 director's couches and shit? Yes, oh, sir. Yeah, it's it's, it's it be a deal. Yeah, you lay, stretch out, crowd that motherfucker, man, get your back blown out, get your other deal. Yeah. So yeah. Would, would you say that's Illuminati or not? Well, 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 well for, for the lack of uh, uh, knowledge of what the Illuminati is, it just means an illuminated one, a lighted one. So a nigga with a bunch of information and, and, and knowledge can be illuminated. So, but what, what's being geared and talked about is a different group of people that's illuminated on what they illuminated on. So, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I know where you're getting at, but I can't just fully go there because I mean, you, I mean, you really so, fuck with So that's what I'm saying. I have to, <laughs> the, 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 what happened on that director's couch, man? Man, uh, what happens on it? I mean, what happened after it? Oh, you good. You, you got your back blown out, man. You get your record deal and, 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 and do what, what's asked of you to do, goddammit, because you've been on that couch. You so so most of the time, the people that say. Is it uh, real? Yeah. I've been on the ninth floor in motherfucking Alex Durell. Yeah. Clyde Davis' office. All this shit that's going on right now in the meeting with P. Diddy and all this. Who the fuck you think P. Diddy work for? And Arista Rebels. Up on the Andre Harrell. Andre Harrell was, was, was Clyde Davis's boy. We on the ninth floor of Arista Rebels. I've been in there. I stood at the desk and watched the boy with the pretty shoes on and a nice suit and the big rock ring. I looked over there at the couch. I said, I ain't sitting down. I'm gonna stand up and do my interview or do whatever we're gonna do, see if we're gonna get, get, get a record deal through Alex. I'm back on the plane going back south, man. You hear me? So, so, have you personally seen people's life change after going into some of them rooms? Oh, man, listen. Listen, man, yeah, it happens. It's real deal. It ain't no joke, man, going around. Start off with the blouse, man. Put on this blouse. That's your mama blouse, man. I'm not putting the shirt on, look like my mama and my old lady blouse. No. You start off with the blouse, then you drink the punch. After the punch, you go in one of the room, man, and get punched. And they take pictures of you, man. And, and all this shit happens, man. It, it really happens. It really happens. Yeah, there ain't no motherfucking secret, nigga. Yeah, the boys be playing. And acting as if it didn't happen. You know, niggas will do anything for money. Oh, man. So you kind of think even Puffy was groomed as, as being one of them type of guys? Say, man. I don't know the nigga personally. I don't know nobody who done slapped him in the back and he done slapped in the back personally. I don't know. But I know where he came from. I know what house he come out of. You know what I'm saying? And they was doing freaky, was saying, they was doing freaky stuff like hey, that. Hey, man, they come out that house. You know what I'm saying? They come out that house, man. You know? Yeah. That's what they did. That boy, that, that boy, that, 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 that white boy, man, he got that knew what he was doing. And he got that. He 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 took who he wanted to take, and went out west, and started him a whole other label, J motherfucking Records, and left the goddamn Arista Records to the nigga boy, cause he done desecrated it and, and done shit it on it so bad, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And that's how the soul got stolen. So you ever wanna know who stole the soul or how the soul got stopped? There you go, right there. They toppled the soul. Through Clyde Davis leaving Arista Records, making L.A. Reid the president of Arista Records.